When someone comes into my clinic and you tell me, I've had chronic pain, I've had that problem for 10 years and it all started here and I've now got pain in my neck, I've got pain in my middle back, I've got pain in my hips, I'm struggling to do this, it's very hard for me to do X, Y and Z and I don't know where to start, when I move it hurts, when I get up it hurts. It can be overwhelming. I mean, having having discomfort, having pain is all overwhelming and we're not sure how that will function, we're not sure how that plays out. But really, the difference when you have chronic pain as opposed to an acute injury is that when you've had an acute injury, your body's already used to moving. Your body's already used to doing something. Maybe you exercise, maybe you, you know, you just get up day to day and perform normal day to day activities. Um, when you've had chronic pain, you become deconditioned because your body doesn't move. It hurts to move, it hurts to exercise, it hurts to get up. So you become very stiff. And not only are you very stiff, but you also become very weak. Some muscles get tight, some muscles don't work. So you have a change in how you use your body. And that's really important to know because a lot of us, when we're in chronic pain, think, yeah, I know I need to exercise. So you go hell for leather trying to move and trying to exercise, where really your body doesn't know the basics. Your body doesn't know what to do. And the most important thing to think about when you're dealing with chronic pain and whether you manage it when you, when you come to somebody like me or whether you manage it because you want to do it on your own is starting with the groundwork and this is the biggest, biggest mistake that I see with most people and that's even with my own profession as a physio and, and it's, it's from a physio and I see a lot of people who have chronic pain a lot of people come to me who have had no benefit or no results of elsewhere um, and the biggest thing is that they started at too high a level. And really when you're in a level of pain and you haven't moved for a number of years, we need to start basic. And basic is basic. Basic's not, I'm gonna go for a walk and I'm gonna start doing boot camp. Basic is, can you hold your body still and move your legs? Can you do this and move your arms? Can you just do pelvic tilts? Can you just do leg slides? Really basic really really basic and normally lying down because you don't have the capacity to be able to hold your body upright and then place movement on it because it hasn't done that for a long time so expecting your body to suddenly be able to do camp or suddenly be able to do gym or suddenly be able to swim or walk can be too much so if you would like to learn more then i run some online programs now message me because starting with the groundwork working from the groundwork up and starting at a level that suits you is where the key is and where the magic lies